Merkitt, he's an Australian architect, never built outside Australia, producing just houses. And he's identified as one of the most famous architects in the world. We present the Pritzker Architectural Prize to Glenn Merkitt. I put Glenn Merkitt in for the last three years. He does wonders with materials that you don't associate with architecture. I feel like a mouse on a wheel going around 24-7. He just improves things. I was astonished when I heard that Glenn was designing a mosque because he's largely resisted public works. I said simply, you're not asking me to design a historic mosque, are you? The answer was no. And that's when I said I could take it on. The Islamic Society of Newport had this grand vision of a building that is representative of tolerance, acceptance, modern Australia. We wanted to invite the community in. Oh, nice to meet you. Hello. This mosque has the potential to actually connect the Islamic community to this country and add another rich layer to this culture. It's a mosque, but it's much, much more. There was a bit of resistance from the Oba uh, parts of the community. We're all anxious about this dream that you've sold us on. The burden of the community and, and their money um, has put a lot of pressure. Some people said that, that I'm only good at houses. Well, time will tell. You feel something coming from his heart. And Mohammed sm is smiling. <laughs> I haven't seen him smile for so long. Architecture is one of those things that you never reach the ultimate. You never reach it. But it's nice to try.